Hey, how's everybody doing today? It's Cup Master Chris. We're back again with another episode of Corona Cup Scout Corner. Okay, today we're going to do a little experiment. This is a nice, easy one. So what you need is you need a glass of water, a nice clear glass so you want to be able to see through it. You're going to need a little bowl to mix your oil in and your um, food coloring together. In. And you're going to need some vegetable oil. Okay, so pause it here and go get a cup full of water, clear, a mixing bowl. Oh, also something to mix it with, some food coloring and vegetable oil. And I'll see you back here in a second. Welcome back. <laughs> All right, everybody. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to first, we're going to mix our oil. So you're going to take your vegetable oil or whatever kind of oil you have. So we know oil and water don't mix, right? We're going to show you something there. So maybe a tablespoon around. Next thing we're going to take, we've got four different colors of food coloring here. Now, what happens if I put food coloring in water? It turns the water a different color, right? So if I put red in this cup of water, it would turn this water red. Right, exactly. What happens if I put food coloring in oil? Let's see. Give you a better view of that. Can you see what's going on there? Not really mixing, is it? Why is that? Because you'll find food coloring is water based and we're putting it into oil. So do they mix? They do not. Okay, so oil molecules are gonna stick to oil molecules and water molecules are gonna stick to water molecules. So here's the thing. If we mix this up, we mix it and mix it. See how it starts breaking all those bubbles apart? Does it mean that they're mixing together? Absolutely not. It does not mean that. They are not mixing together. What they're simply doing, breaking into little, little finer, finer bubbles. Okay. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to bring our cup of water out here. Okay. I've got more light on it. Maybe it would be a little more. Better? Okay, so we're gonna take our mixture of the um, food coloring and oil, and it's still in little globs. We're gonna pour that right in there. See what happens? Of course, they separate. Okay, what happens next? To give it a second, if you can, you can just start to see it now. Let me see if I can change the angle. All right, here we go. Just starting to see it. So what's happening? The food coloring is separating out of the oil, right? I'm gonna time lapse it because it probably takes a couple minutes. So let me pause this. Uh, it's starting a little more there now. See, and that's only about, oh, 30 seconds in. About 30 seconds in right there. I'm gonna pause it again. I uh, see we're another 30 seconds in. So it's moving along pretty quickly, right? That is pretty neat. Pretty neat. So what do you think? Cool experiment, right? What would happen if you threw an alka seltzer tablet? What would happen? That's an experiment for you to try. Okay. So everybody, I hope you had fun with this experiment today. We're going to do something different again tomorrow. So I want everybody to stay healthy and safe. Um, and, and remember, I asked you guys to clean up some garbage. I've also asked you to do some board games. I asked you to do something nice for somebody, right? So if you could continue on with those, and you know, it's always a good practice to be nice to somebody, right? Okay. Sometimes you just have to not argue and just take the high road, right? Especially with our siblings, we're trapped here and, and these four walls are closing in on us and, and the littlest things sometimes irritate us, right? So sometimes we just have to let those things go, okay? Remember, take a, take a 10 count if you need to. Go to a different room, go outside, go wherever you have to go. I know, I know it's hard, but together we're going to get through this. All right, so I want everybody to please stay healthy, stay safe. Come back here and see me again tomorrow. Take care, everybody. Bye.